for May 28th, 2015. Here's a breaking headline. Ebola. Ebola. Ebola virus outbreak hits the United States. Oh, oh wait a minute. Uh, we don't hear much talk about uh, Ebola. That kind of just fizzled out. But what is the latest fear tactic from the powers that be, the elite? What are they really up to? What do we have now? We've got anthrax. An anthrax scare. Here's the headline. I'll put the link below. I'm not going to put a lot of time and waste my energy on this. But we got to take a look at what could really be going on while they're bringing a report like this to draw all your attention, like they did with Ebola, to this live anthrax spores. Pentagon says it accidentally shipped nine live anthrax spores. Washington Associated Press, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention said Wednesday, Ebola. No, it said it's investigating what the Pentagon called an inadvertent shipment of live anthrax spores to government and commercial laboratories in as many as nine states as well as one overseas that expected uh, to receive dead spores. At this time, we do not suspect any risk they're not saying that there won't be a risk. They don't suspect any risk to the general public. CDC spokeswoman Kathy Harbin said, a Pentagon spokesman, Colonel Stephen Warren, said the suspected live anthrax samples were shipped from Dugway Proving Ground, an army facility in Utah, using a commercial delivery service. Warren said the government has confirmed one recipient, a laboratory in Maryland, received live spores. It is suspected, but not yet confirmed, that anthrax sent to labs in as many as eight other states also contained live spores. He said later, uh, he said, later he said an anthrax sample from the same batch at Dugway also was sent to a U.S. military laboratory at Osan Air Force Base in Korea, South Korea. No personnel there have shown signs of exposure, he said, and the sample was destroyed. And now I'm going to put the link below. Take a deep breath. Ebola. What happened to the Ebola virus? And uh, could this be a false flag? Uh, be, be concerned, but don't focus all of your attention. Don't follow the hype and the fear and the hysteria uh, that many people on YouTube have put out to boost their ratings. Take a look at this. Pentagon says it accidentally shipped nine live anthrax spores. What, what could they be doing while well, they've got your attention drawn over here to this live anthrax threat? We've got Operation Jade Helm coming up on July uh, through September and they do want to bring down the population uh, Agenda 21 this could be a legitimate threat, but don't put all your eggs in one basket. Take a look around. Take a deep breath. What executive order could Barack Obama be trying to uh, sign while your attention is drawn over here? Or what major event could be taking place that they don't want you to know about, so they want to draw your attention to this anthrax threat? And it's not the first time. There have been many anthrax threats and, and, and envelopes being shipped with this powdery substance so be awake be informed and be ready have a plan i'll be right back because i have something uh, a video that uh, you may want to be concerned about especially if you live in michigan subscribe to my channel